We're usually telling you about wildfires in the West, but because of the record high temperatures in March, every state that touches the Atlantic is abnormally dry or in a drought. And wildfires have sprung up near Miami, Florida. Brush fires are burning near Roanoke, Virginia. Firefighters are battling a big fire on New York's Long Island. And that's where Jim Axelrod is tonight. The nasty wildfires whipping through Long Island, stirred by 40 mile per hour winds, are not normally seen in this part of the country at this time of year. New York's Governor Andrew Cuomo understands the danger. All the ingredients were there uh, for a real uh, tragedy. The red flag conditions that create explosive potential for fires to spread will continue to pose a growing threat for months to come according to Suffolk County Fire Commissioner Joe Williams. If the conditions are right with the low humidity, very dry and a windy condition, you can have a major fire. Williams blames the warm, dry winter that's continued into spring. It was the hottest March on record, 8.6 degrees above average. More than 15,000 warm temperature records were broken. As we're walking through this, just a, a cigarette butt would set this off. Absolutely. This tall grass, this dry grass we have here would definitely set that off. Those severe drought conditions that extend all the way down to Florida are creating dire challenges for firefighters like Scott Peterich of the Florida Forest Service. It went from one acre to 40 acres in a matter of about 20 minutes, so it, it can move very fast. The blessing many found in a snowless winter, 20 inches below average in New York City, is quickly becoming the firefighters' curse. Jim Axelrod joins us in Manorville, New York. And Jim, you were telling us in the newsroom earlier that these warmer temperatures pretend some other things for the weather. Well, that's right, Scott. I mean, ocean temperatures are warmer as well, and warmer water strengthens hurricanes. So let's look ahead a little bit. Late summer, fall hurricane season. As hurricanes start to make their way up the Atlantic coast, they may very well be much stronger than we're used to seeing, Scott. It's going to be an interesting spring and summer. Jim, thanks very much.